the Bangladesh government don't say they won't help Nigeria federal government to boost food production and revive the nation's textile industries when they don't they down. The Bangladeshi High Commissioner to Nigeria, Chamin Hassan, as the young with talk talk people for Abuja say Bangladesh, with about 167 million for population and the eighth largest country for Southeast Asia, get to bunga textile industry and they get plenty of food for the people. Hassan say Bangladesh, they open to help Nigeria people to solve some of their challenges, especially for the areas of food production and security, and they're ready to support. I think uh, uh, there are very um, uh, clear areas I can see where we can collaborate uh, for a mutual benefit. Uh, one would be in the field of agriculture, uh, where we have a tremendous experience. As I told that Bangladesh achieved uh, self-sufficiency in food production. Another area could be uh, definitely uh, trade and commerce and uh, we can benefit mutually. As I mentioned that we received many requests, many times, to help Nigeria to rebuild or to help bring back the past glory of Nigeria to revive its glory in textile industry. So this could be one of the areas. And uh, we, have, we are a success story. We are a voice of moderation. Bangladesh is a secular country, and is a, it symbolizes communal harmony. And it also successfully arrested any kind of extremist trend. Uh, and it was made possible because of the zero tolerance policy again about uh, any kind of militancy or extremism. As uh, followed by the Honorable Prime Minister Sheikh Hassan and her government. When I meet the Nigerian dignitaries, uh, I say the same thing. The, the areas of cooperation, as I mentioned, that it could be um, the field of um, agriculture, education, defense cooperation, and um, uh, trade and commerce, including uh, uh, textile and garments and joint venture uh, sort of uh, activity, uh, inbound or outbound investment, which is uh, mutually beneficial.